Here's how to get up and running with Wheelo. Wheelo is designed to work with Zoom. Sign up with your Zoom account to integrate Zoom's audio, video, and screen sharing, as well as features like recording and transcription. If you prefer not to integrate Zoom, there's an alternative version available, which you can enable by signing up with your email address. Check out our user guide for more information. Make sure to click Allow to authorize Wheelo to work with your Zoom account and import account information like your name and profile photo. You'll begin by creating your first Wheelo space. Scroll through the space layout options to find the space that best suits your team. Then give it a name and click Confirm to create the space. And here's your new Wheelo space. Let's take a look around. Spaces are divided into rooms, and each room is a separate area where you can hold meetings, chat with others, or just sit at your desk and get work done. Start by double-clicking on any seat in any room to enter the space. In Wheelo, everyone is represented by their own personal avatar. Use the right side panel to zoom in and out on the space, and click Locate to find yourself in the space. Rooms work a little bit like they do in a physical office. You're going to need to be in the same room as others to start a call and to hear and see each other. You can move to a new seat in the room or indeed move to another room in the space by double clicking or by clicking and dragging your avatar. Now that you've created your Wheelo space, you're going to want to bring in some colleagues to test things out with you. Use the left-hand navigation panel to click on people and invite others as members of your space. Or copy the guest link to provide temporary access with just that link, where your guests can pop the link in their browser and instantly join you. Now, once that person joins you, you're probably going to want to talk to them. Click Start Call at the bottom of your screen to open a Zoom meeting right there in your Wheelo space. Now, you've already linked your Zoom account with Wheelo during sign up, which allows you to start calls. The person you've invited in, they can join the call without linking their Zoom account, but they're just going to need to link their account later when they want to start, um, uh, start their own calls. Now, the Zoom meeting window it opens up. You can reposition it in the space. Use the controls either in the meeting window for your mic and camera, or use the controls at the bottom of your screen. You can access settings through the gear icon to select a new mic or camera device. When it's time to end or leave the meeting, you can use the controls, or you can simply leave the room. All right, let's dig into setting up your space. Now, rooms are not just places where you can hold meetings. They can also be used to communicate to your team, organize information, and share updates. Configure rooms using the navigation panel on the left or by right-clicking in a room. Select Change Room Settings to name the room, which can be for a team function, uh, perhaps their location, a project being worked on, or even something that reflects your team's culture. Edit Room Welcome Message allows you to create a pop-up message that automatically displays for any user who enters the room. Use this to share an announcement or provide instructions, um, and you can add text, images, or even videos. And again, this will automatically display for any user when they enter the room. You can also embed applications, documents, project dashboards, or really any web-based resource into the room. This creates super easy access to information and tools for your team, so you don't have to go searching for the links. Everything you need to get the job done is right there in the room. First, click Resources, and then the gear icon. This is where you will add the resources so you can later assign them to the rooms. Just add uh, the name or title and the URL. 
and then select the space or spaces that you want that resource to be available in. Then click Assign, and you can do this in any room, and select the resources that you want to assign. You'll see this makes the resource easily visible from the room name, and any team member can click on it to open it. Wheelo has meeting tools to help keep everyone on track for group discussions. Set timers for individual rooms or the entire space. Send a message to everyone in the space or quickly pull everyone into your room with Ask Everyone to Join. If you want to create additional spaces or change the layout of your space, go to Space Settings. Here you can create more spaces or click the pencil icon to find Advanced Settings where you can choose a new layout, configure some of the settings, um, and manage your members and access roles. As a user, you can also configure your Wheelo profile and experience by going to More, My Settings, or by clicking on your profile picture. Here you can update your time zone and language, set notification preferences, and integrate Google Calendar and Slack. I hope this was helpful as a quick start guide. Check out our user guide or contact us through the live chat option to get more support. Thanks.